Hey there, it's Lenny McGill with the Glock Store Performance and Custom Shop here in the Nashville studios today. And I'm gonna show you a couple custom guns with particular emphasis on the new laser stippling that we are providing that I think looks pretty cool. And here it is right here, check this out. This is a, uh, a Glock 43 X and um, started off as black. We Cerakoted it and then uh, laser stippled as you can see. And I hope you can see the texture in there. Uh, the, um, uh, the grip panels, which one look pretty cool, but also, you know, give you a, uh, a good grip uh, because it's anti-slip just based upon the way it's, it's built. You know, it's not going to get wet and slippery. Uh, it's really a beautiful gun that we've got, like I said, a, a, a kind of a green Cerakote with this laser. Uh, this gun is totally tricked out. It's got our 507K uh, uh with our combat cut, which puts the rear sight in front of the optic. And that allows you to really co-witness better, uh, I think. And um, I just love that green optic. It, this is a, uh, a green circle dot uh, for this uh, Hullison, really cool. But the, um, uh, the co-witness of the uh, optics with the front sight means that you're basically lining up the iron sights with the red dot. And so it's kind of a, a confirmation that, yes, everything's working, and you're, you're mounting the gun and placing the gun perfectly where it should be. You know, and, and that's really what uh, the co-witness is all about. Now, if the sight were to fail, the iron sights still work. And that's the other uh, other side of that. This gun also features our new um, EDC magwell. Check that out. There's the magazine. Gun is, of course, empty. Boom. There's a new magwell. Pretty cool, pretty tight. What that does is it allows you to get your hand up higher. It kind of pushes your hand up because it just gives you something to rest on. The other thing I find about the uh, magwells, whichever one they are really, is they, they give you a reference point. So you know as you mount the gun that you're in the same spot every time. It feels the same every time because you can feel that pressure right there in the same spot. Now that's so important for accuracy because accuracy is about consistency and consistency in your grip is where accuracy starts. If you can get on the gun the same way and present it the same way, that means you can shoot a lot faster because you're not looking for the sights. The sights are already there. I've said that over and over again in a lot of different videos, but that's basically how I feel about uh, mounting the gun and, and being consistent with the grip. One of the reasons I like uh, the uh, magwells. Magwells do fit with all the different uh, mag extensions as well as all the factory mags. Now, this gun also features one of my favorite finishes, the NP3 uh, finish for the slide. And that is kind of a silvery look, right? It's kind of a satiny uh, finish. NP3 is a, um, a lubricating finish, kind of like a Teflon for your gun. It's used in the aerospace industry, and uh, it's, it's really a, a beautiful finish in, in many ways. One, it looks good. It's, it's just pretty. Two, it cleans up so easy because it's kind of Teflon. You can just wipe it down. Um, and it always looks the same. I mean, it doesn't change, it doesn't wear much. You know? So you're going to find NP3 as a, as a great finish if you're interested in that two-tone look. Uh, it's got this uh, Streamlight um, TLR7 sub, which is the small light for your small guns, and you can see how it fits nicely there. It operates with these paddles. You push down and push up, and, and basically uh, uh, it's, it's, it's a neat little light, you know, if you're looking for a light to go with your gun. Now, we do make holsters that fit this entire combo as well. It's kind of a specialty little holster. You can do it inside the waistband. That's what's nice about uh, the 43X. It's slim enough to be inside the waistband with a light and a laser. So uh, a great option, lots of things to think about. Uh, it's also got our pyramid trigger, which is super crisp, super light, resets instantly almost, so you can really manipulate that trigger without disturbing the sight picture. And finally, it's got our tungsten guide rod, a pure tungsten guide rod. That's gonna help reduce any kind of recoil and muzzle flip. Uh, it's a good looking gun functional, better than the original Glock because of all the accessories. Um, well, I think you're, you know, if you're looking for some custom work, we do custom guns here. And you can be any color, any size, you know, I mean, this, you know, they take a little bit of time, but at the end of the day, you get exactly what you want. And that's what our custom shop's all about. I've got a couple guys dedicated to doing custom. Our machine shop can cut and do all kinds of slides. Uh, the laser stippling is in place now. We've got a couple different options on the website. Uh, pyramid triggers are running and running strong. Uh, 
would love to help you uh, build a custom gun. Now, here's another option uh, that we just built. We're about to send this to a customer. This is a Glock 19 Gen 5. Now, this features the standard footprint for your optic with the suppressor sights. This is a uh, 509T, and um, it's got, you know, it's, it's enclosed, which is one of the nice things about uh, the uh, concealed carry concept. A lot of people are concerned that the uh, open light source or diode that projects the laser up onto the glass may get obstructed by some lint or something, you know, as you carry it every day, all of a sudden, you know, dust gets in there, just like, you know, normal. So the new trend is to go with a, a, a completely enclosed optic. Either way, as long as you keep it clean, you're fine. But understanding that the, uh, the box uh, concept has a reason because they're, they're protecting that light emitting diode, the LED that's actually projecting the uh, laser onto the glass. The other thing here, of course, is uh, we also, I wanted to show you now, we're, we're kind of talking about our laser stippling. This has the same pattern on black on black. So it's pretty cool. You probably don't see as much detail because of, you know, just the way it is. But this guy uh, is the Glock 19 Gen 5. This is the 43X. And you can see one of the other things, too. A lot of people wonder, you know, they're almost the same profile, the Glock 19 and the uh, 43X. It's just the 43X is slimmer. And that's why it's, in my mind, a superior carry gun because it's more comfortable. If it's more comfortable, you're going to carry it just like that. I often forget when I have it on. It's that easy to carry in my little simple $35 holster. Okay, now, uh, a couple other things in here. Pyramid trigger, like I said. This is the curved pyramid trigger. And um, all the pyramid triggers now are non-adjustable. We adjust them here from the factory. This one is sweet. I tell you, it's probably about a three-pound trigger. And the reset is so tight. So I, I'm really impressed with this trigger. I'm impressed with this uh, new laser stippling. I hope you are too. Uh, we've, like I said, we've got a several different patterns to look at and to do uh, on your gun. And basically the, the fact is, is you can send us your gun. We'll go ahead and do the work and we'll send it back. Just that simple. So we've got, a, like I said, a dedicated custom team ready to help you out and help you design the gun that you're looking for from scratch. Okay, there's no two are alike. You know, we, we get guns... Every day, and we're working on it every day. So uh, we turn around as fast as possible. A lot of this custom work does take time, so be patient. Like I said, two custom guns ready to go to customers. Thank you for watching. If you've got a custom idea, don't hesitate to give us a call. We'll see you next time. Thank you. <laughs>